Welcome to Crystal Maker 10. In this tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how you can use the Leap Motion 3D controller to rotate and scale your structure. The Leap Motion controller is a simple USB device that plugs into your Mac or PC and allows you to control your system using simple hand gestures. And we programmed Crystal Maker to work with this device. Now in this demonstration, I'm going to assume that you have purchased your device and plugged it into your machine and followed the manufacturer's instructions to download and install their driver software. Once that's been completed, then you can launch Crystal Maker and on launch Crystal Maker looks for the Leap Motion controller and if it's installed it will allow you to use your hand gestures to rotate and scale your structure. Now there are two different ways of manipulating your structure with the Leap Motion controller. You can use the two-handed method which many users will find more intuitive and more powerful or you can use a one-handed method which is used for rotation only but sometimes can be more convenient if you want to use your other hand for something. Now to use the two-handed gesture you need to position both of your hands above the controller with your palms facing downwards and your fingers splayed out and then you can rotate just by imagining that you have a ball between your hands, a solid ball, and you're turning that about different axes. You'll notice that the model rotates as well. You can also scale. Imagine that you're squeezing your virtual ball or that you're pulling it apart. Again, squeezing it in, pulling it apart, squeezing, pulling, squeezing, pulling. The other set of gestures is the one-handed gesture. Position your hand above the device to rotate about a virtual axis coming from the table up to your hand. You can also rotate about an axis that comes out of the screen towards you. Positioning your hand in front of the screen, twisting. Or there's a third axis which is parallel to the screen parallel to the controller and just rotate, simple rotation. Finally, I want to say something about how you can stop the device from tracking your hand. Why would you want to do that? Well, sometimes if you position your hands above the device and then move them away, then your structure will move and you don't want that. Your structure will rotate because your hand motion triggers a response. So we programmed the device so that if you put your fingers together, it will cease tracking. You put your fingers apart and it'll track. Put your fingers together and it will stop tracking. So that's a good way to withdraw your hands without having your structure rotate or scale on you. Finally, remember you need to have your palms pointing downwards towards the device so that the camera can see what you're doing. And that's the Leap Motion 3D controller that works with Crystal Maker 10. 